Hello, welcome to Galpanash. This is episode 50... Million. Eight? I'm back to not being able to remember. Um, today, uh, I am Alex. Uh, Emmy! Today, we are drinking what I believe is straight out of Harry Potter. Um, no, that's butter beer. I don't know. If it was officially licensed, it would probably say Harry Potter on it, though, right? Okay, so this is a knockoff Harry Potter. It's, uh... It's butterbeer, but not butterscotch beer. I never watched Harry Potter. Did you ever watch Harry Potter? I never read Harry Potter. Did you ever read Harry Potter? I watched, like, the third movie because Lily and Rose, I was spending the night at their house and they wanted to watch it. So they made me watch Was it. butter beer in it? Set up straight. No. And also, the people, they were still, they're still children and yet they're drinking butter beer. I like it. Root beer isn't beer? No, but like according to someone who actually watched the series, Hermione got drunk. But was it drunk or was it like magic drunk? Was it like... <laughs> Pretty sure it's still illegal. Why? Why? It could be totally different from alcohol. Maybe this is doing something totally different in magic world. Look, the point is we don't know because magic doesn't exist. So Maybe we can't. It does and you don't know. We can't put our laws and rules and regulations onto a magic fantasy land. Magic fantasy lands, magic things might be totally different than what we have in our world. We can't regulate that. Look, the senators and, and stuff like that, they can't even figure out how to regulate Facebook. You really think they're going to be able to figure out how to regulate uh, magic? Maybe, maybe magic does exist, and that's exactly why the magic people hide it. Yeah, because if you find out that you have any sort of, like, incredible ability, you should definitely hide it. Like, 100%. That's the first thing. You, if you find out how to fly or turn invisible or the, uh, do any sort of magic, I know how to fly. Hide it. I know how to fly. You just get on an airplane. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's the same thing with uh, if you win the lottery. Don't tell people. Same thing if you find out you can fly. Don't tell anyone, because then you will be dissected. Not the same with the lottery, but don't tell anyone. <laughs> I mean, with the lottery, might... with the lottery, everyone will just want want you to give them money. Or but, rob you. Yeah, but if you find out you can fly, and then the government finds out, then you will definitely be dissected. Like they will, they will capture you and do or tests on you. And then when they can't figure it out, they will eventually kill you and cut you open and try to figure out why you can fly. And then Definitely. You, and then they find out you're just a robot that didn't know it was a robot that had jetpacks in its feet. And then you come back alive and kill them. That's a movie. We could make that movie. That'd be great. Name of the movie? Dissected. Di di Dissected. Dissected. Robot flight man. No. Magic. You're giving away all the things. <laughs> That's what a successful movie does nowadays. It gives away all the plot points. Anyway, this is Butterscotch Beer from Harry Potter. We have no idea anything about Harry Potter. We never read them. She reads lots of fantasy books, but never got into Harry Potter. It smells like butterscotch. Oh, good. I would hope so, because it's supposed to taste like butterscotch, too. Generally, I like the things that I uh, find to taste like something to also smell like that thing. It's a very sweet butterscotch, and, and I would say it reminds me more of butterscotch pudding than it does like a butterscotch candy. Like, you know, you used to, you used to always like find those caramel. little orange or yellow, I think they were orange, discs, like circles. Like hard candies that were butterscotch. We have those at mom's right now. It looks like melted caramel. Or like. Are you gonna hit me in the face when I? No. When I go off? <laughs> <laughs> All right. I tricked him.
Yeah. <laughs> I, made, I, made, I assaulted my father. <laughs> no, I made him think I was going to trick him. <coughs> I tricked him into make. No, I didn't. Then you did. No, I just jolted it up like a little bit. I wasn't Which actually is, going to yeah. hit you. You might have. Uh, yeah, it's all right. It tastes like a butterscotch thing. Um, I'm not. I'm not real crazy about the butterscotch flavor. Um, but it's fine. That's fine. Could it, go uh, fly around on your broom, playing Quidditch, and drink a uh, butterscotch beer Quidditch. from the Ministry of Magical Excuse me. Drinks. And What's and um, Quidditch? and um. I don't know more Harry Potter things. Hermione. Ron. <laughs> Bird, bir birdies, beans, one of those jelly beans, birdie bot, and that the lady <laughs> with the jelly beans, birdie bot, and um, birdie wands, box. and the lightning, dad birdie box, lightning scar, is the scar on his forehead or his cheek? <laughs> it's across his eye. No! <laughs> it's, it's cheek and forehead. It's across his eye. And glasses. And the dude without a nose. What's the guy without his nose? What's his name? <laughs> Dumbledore. Snape. Or <sighs> Snape, Dumbledore, or there was another one. Voldemort. Voldemort. There you go. Is That's... he the one without the yeah. nose or is Snape the one without no, the nose? No, it's Voldemort. Snape is, um, <laughs> Snape is that dude with the voice. It was the voice of God in Dogma. <laughs> the Meta, the Metatron. What's his name? <laughs> and he's dead now. <laughs> he was Snape, right? Is he Snape? I don't know who Snape is. You don't know either. <laughs> Why are you laughing? You don't know. I know so much more than it, about Harry Potter than you. Is that a point of pride? Like, is that <laughs> is that something to brag about? It's just a it's just a book You're series. You're embarrassing yourself. There are millions of book series in the world. Why does it? Why why is it a point of ridicule if somebody doesn't uh, know anything about one specific book series? It's, it's not it's not Shakespeare. Sorry Harry Potter fans, it's, it ain't Shakespeare. It's, about it's not going to go down in time. Nobody's going to remember it in 100 years. It's about as big as Shakespeare. No it isn't. The size of people who actually like Shakespeare is about the same. As his pop, as the popular. Like <laughs> you just threw shade at Shakespeare. <laughs> you can't do that. Yes, it's freaking I Shakespeare. Can. He's the uh, epitome of classic <laughs> literature. You can't you can't throw shade at him. Well I just did. You can't! <laughs> it's just against the law. You just can't. I just did. Shade for Shakespeare. No. <laughs> no. That, uh, was... <laughs> you didn't even let me finish throwing my shade. This wasn't... This doesn't even have a name. That was butterscotch beer. Like, that's not the name, right? That's not the name <laughs> of a drink. Is magical foods and drinks... That was the ministry. That was uh, the minute approved by the Ministry of Magical Foods and Drinks. Butterscotch beer, non-alcoholic, premium for all ages. If uh, you want to try premium non-alcoholic butterscotch beer for all ages, approved by the Ministry of Magical Foods and Drinks, go out to your local store and look for premium non-alcoholic butterscotch beer for all ages, approved by the Ministry of Magical Foods and Drinks. I finished throwing my shade at Shakespeare now. No. <laughs> yes. <coughs> Shakespeare is shadeless. Shakespeare's classic. 
Mm. And that's why I know younger people like it. Because <laughs> you didn't bother to read it or understand it. Yeah, because you did and you're old. Oh, you think I read something that I was supposed to in school? You are sorely mistaken. <laughs> we had spark notes when I was in school. You don't know what that is, but that's what we had. Nobody read anything. Exactly. You're old. We read spark notes and then did the test. You're 36, aren't you? No, 34. <laughs> <laughs> Like and subscribe <laughs> in the D box. He's wah, wah, now. There is a link to our Discord and our email if you want to talk to us. There's also a link for our merch, our Patreon, and our Stream Labs. And also, if you want to donate. And also in the comments, say no. Happy double Goodbye. birthday to Dad. Happy double birthday. Goodbye. That would only Happy make me thirty-five. <laughs> No, it's a double. I would need to have two double a, birthdays. To no, make it's a me double. It's a double birthday. That means it counts for two birthdays. So you're 36 now. Happy but it's double not my birthday. birthday! Yes, it is. If the last is. birthday was a double birthday, it would only make me 35. I haven't had my next birthday yet. No, it's only this birthday. No, but I, I haven't had it yet. It's every birthday in the future, and today is your birthday from now on. No. Yeah. You can't change my birthday. <laughs> yes, I can. No, you can't. From now on, he only has double birthdays. Come on, from now on, you only have negative birthdays, so happy eight years old. You're now eight years old. That wouldn't even be my baby. age. You're now a baby. Bite your ankles. Stop drinking beer, baby. Not allowed to drink beer, baby. It's the wrong bottle, baby. Go get your milk bottle. <laughs> Chug a 40. <laughs> Don't say that. You're not allowed you to say that. that. No, you I didn't. Yes, you did. You told did me what not. a 40 was. No. You did. I didn't. You did. You it's, so did. That's something it's, homeless people drink out of. No, it's a video. It's on a video on this channel. I know it. I'm not looking for it. I know Goodbye. it is. Goodbye. I